Well, welcome to today's part of the mini build. Um, as you can see, I've been starting to cut things around. Uh, this little yeah. panel, I'm just gonna cut some holes in, you know, drill some holes. Now the other panel will slip up behind it and the seam weld down there as well. Not quite sure what I'm gonna do down here because uh, this seal is gonna be replaced as well. So the other things so I might make that with a little out on it as well. So it'll weld together. And then I'm going to cut off these over seals. That's the plan for the day, so nothing too exciting. And see what's behind there. Let's get cutting. Well, here you go. This is what uh, this is what we're looking at under here. This literally was covering up the original seals. So you can see these have been dented in, obviously to make sure that thing covered it over. Um, I actually thought the inner seals were all right, but uh, it does turn out I've got a little hole here and there. I did prod them around from the inside of the car and they seemed all right. But I might have to make a few little repairs to that, especially at the back here. As you can see, that's like uh, part of the floor pan there, inside the companion bin. So, there you go. And the actual inside of this panel. Okay, there's a little bit of, uh, a little bit of rust there, but like up here, it actually looks all right. So, cover seals, yeah. If you want to take them off and use them for something else, that's what they're good for. And there we go. That's all the mess it's made. <laughs> Mad, isn't it, eh? Crazy. So, yep. Yeah, I might just cut that last little front piece off. Let's just rip that down. There we go. So, yeah. I might just cut this last little front piece off. And then look at cutting this out because the new that's the new panel I've got is this short panel so across there and it comes to here so I've got to make sure that this part of the floor is all good for the moment that's just a bit crusty but I might end up replacing that I don't know I was hoping not to all right there you go let's cut this I'll show you this off. where this cover seal was fitted look it's only been just tack welded along the edges in a few places you can actually peel this part down look so it wasn't really even on the car properly there you go look i cut through it there and look that's how far the welds are apart so it's just a little tack there a little tack there um yeah and the next one's right along here so christ it was literally just touched on there wasn't it I, mean, it's, I think it's gonna be the same underneath here you know i haven't really had a good dig at this bit yet oh look at that look i just pulled that off so yeah there's only just little tack welds here and there literally just to cover it wow huh? you don't huh? oh, i won't feel i'll film your shoes so you're not going to help me I will. you will yeah you said that on camera now I know. you've got to help me I know. so how about you can sweep all that lot up. Yeah, you can do that. Not? God, cheap of it. As much as I've done, I haven't cut that little bit off yet. But just started cleaning this up, and as you can see, it's really pitted and very thin in places. So, no doubt I'll end up uh, putting some new metal in there because it certainly needs it. I'm just looking under here as well few little holes but from this point inwards it all seems absolutely perfect well apart from not the front here obviously but the actual main floor section so but you can see where this uh, cover seal was tacked little tack there little tack there tiny little one there you know it's it's literally just hanging on there how did that get away with an MOT and stuff it's incredible but yeah like you can see you know there's, there's holes all in this inner panel here so just going to put some new steel in there 
it's fairly simple it's just a folded piece of metal isn't it and that then can give us air gusset on the inside of the uh, hill board as well <clears throat> and then up in this there's this little panel here as well which is going to join onto there so there's plenty to do and I can, ooh, I can pull the rust out of here as well look at that <laughs> mini problems yeah so much of it but lots more to do. I've got to figure out a way of getting this ramp out of the way as well. I think it's about the only problem with a two poster ramp doing sills. It's always in the way. Right then people, well, that's gonna be it for today. I was gonna cut the other side off as well, but hopefully got a visitor turning up in a mo. So I'll try and film some of that as well. So back in a nanosecond, hopefully with a visitor. Hello, just sweeping my mini up. I'm gonna weld it all back together. All these little pieces. <laughs> there you go. Pile of mini that. You can't drive them. Look at that! Three of us in the mini! Hey. Dave in the back. Yeah. And we ain't lost the exhaust yet. <laughs> the suspension's that good. Yeah. We're doing well.